Okay, what are some features of the spreader bar? Well, some features are the main blue bar, which is a three bag lift by itself. Uh, the clevis clamps go on all four corners of it, which is for your hooks and your cables for the, for the crane to lift and move. Um, each unit comes with magnetic lights, so if you trailer it, you got lights on, on the back end of it. Um, clevis clamps, all the bolts, all the safety pins that are here. Um, and uh, uh, it comes on with, a, with its own axle and hitch that are easily removed after you take the weight off of the bar. Um, it, all you got to do is un, uh, untie or un, unbolt everything uh, <coughs> and then undo the safety pins. And then the white extension pieces go out and the red pieces, you would unbolt them and undo the safety pins. And two guys can do it. Uh, lift it up and then put it in place of the white pieces that, that you just removed. Um, or a forklift could come in and pick it up uh, through the fork, fork area, lift it up and then put it in uh, on the sides. Um, the hooks here is what you put the bags up to um, underneath. All the, all the hooks need to be lined up the same direction and you can double them up where you put the loops on them and once the loops are on, top, on them, how many? Uh, raise it up uh, nice and slow it'll be a nice even lift all 15 feet um, and then you have a tag line connected to the bar which will allow you to rotate it into place wherever you need it um, we have used excavators where we've only filled up uh, maybe 8 to 10 inches inside of a full five bag system and the lighter excavators uh, were able to then pick it up and then pivot it and put it into place for a stream diversion um, it's very, very useful tool uh, for that.